Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Back with Deck Deck, and today we're playing some more Green Hell, and we're doing the survival challenges. In our last episode, we got the walkie-talkie from this little camp. Now we've got to head to 37 west, so we've got to go east, and 18 south. I don't think I can get that way. I'm going to have to go back around, aren't I? God damn it, leeches. Come on. I'm hoping... That we're not going to need food doing this challenge. Because I've not got any. I've only got a few of the blue mushrooms left. 46. 45. Yeah, 45. It's alright, it's a tapia. Running along the road. Well, the road. Yes, this is road. Running across the path is a lot nicer. And we need to be slightly more north than what we are. Come on, let me up. Don't be funny with it. In fact, what have we got to eat? Eat one of them. Eat one of them. It was a bad idea to eat that, but luckily I'd got the mushrooms on me already. Just wanted to top off. In fact, it's water that we need more than anything. We'll be fine. We do need to go more south now, though. <clears throat> so it just keeps sprinting through the jungle. I probably don't want to be up here. <coughs> Are we even going to be able to get where we need to be? So this is the edge of the cliff, isn't it? Back up here. It's on the other side of this rock, isn't it? Oh, straight through there. Yes, good. Grab some bananas while we can. I should keep my eyes out for the orange fruits as well because they do give you water. Oh, I know exactly what camp it is. <clears throat> this is a camp me and Brittany go to quite often, unintentionally. Yeah, I know where we're heading now. snare trap. I've not snared it, luckily. Come on. Now, I'm not going to continue this video into the next uh, survival challenge if we finish it as soon as I get the batteries. Uh, 37, 18... This might not be the camp I thought it was. We're nearly at 37. Yeah, it is. Excuse me. It's just going to be slightly up, tucked onto a hill. Now that's the top of a rock. Ant's nest, avoid that. I need a better angle. <clears throat> yeah, this is the camp, I'm sure it is. I like it how they don't notice if you get a headshot. Around this side. <laughs> Where 
Where's the rest of my arrows? You will run. I don't think we need to get any more arrows. This is kind of the end of the challenge, is it not? I'll need to pick up batteries. <clears throat> but where did the rest of my arrows go? Because I killed the dudes. Uh, I No, I didn't harvest all of them, did I? That's it. Wow. We smashed that one. Tell you what then, being as I did that in like five minutes, which I should really do one challenge in one video, I think, which is what I'm going to do from now on. Um, let me just quickly show you what me and Brittany have been up to. <clears throat> because the reason I asked Brittany to play Green Hell is because I wanted to get some practice in for these challenges. And the practice clearly is paying off quite well. Now, if you remember the channel update, if you're interested in Green Hell and you watched the last video update and saw what our base looked like before, it was like a couple of little buildings and we'd got everything spread out. This one isn't like that at all. We went a completely different way. We knew of somewhere that was uh, nice to build. You'll probably recognize the location if you're a Green Hell player. But we wanted to get a nice big building. So, this is my bedroom. And then this is Brittany's bedroom. We've not got anything fancy in the bedrooms yet. I decided to have a bit of a window in mine. Just so I can like see straight through. And I've got <clears throat> a little bit of a fire and a log bed. Brittany's just got a normal bed with the looks of it. Um, but yeah. This is our base. <laughs> it's a bit different, isn't it? To um, what we'd done last time. Oh, I'm going to need sleep, aren't I? In fact, I don't want to sleep. Yeah, we are at the smuggler's den. The bandit camp, whatever it is. We cut down all of the drugs and we've just built on flat ground. So what have we got? We've got nuts, nuts, nuts. Uh, then we're growing the unknown fruit, the ones that get rid of parasites. We've got the orange fruits growing in these two, tobacco growing in them two, and then three lots of bananas. We have got a mud bath, as you can see, a mud shower even, because we got tired of running all the way down there to go and uh, wash ourselves off to water collectors. That one's actually finished. We've not started making metal yet, but we are ready to be making metal. Uh, we've built everything inside or on the base so that the tribesmen can't actually kill us. Or break anything, sorry, is more the point. Because they are quite the nightmare for breaking things. I just realised I never got a screenshot for the, uh, the last episode. Well, I guess we're going to take a screenshot of this base then, aren't we? Ah, that's better. My stats are awfully low. Anyway, let's go downstairs and then I can hopefully show you some of this stuff off. Uh, none of it is cooked, is it? Well, we're a little bit short on supplies, I guess. But yeah, that's the cooking corner. I do want to get another little chest somewhere around here so we can put like cooked food and dried food in there. So we can continuously get more being dried or cooked up. Over this way we've got like stones over there. These hold 40 each. It's ridiculous. Big stone storage. Palm leaves. Banana leaves. And then we've got the new rope holders. Well, the, in fact this entire corner is new stuff, isn't it? They added it in the uh, latest patch, I believe. Over this way we've got storage. We've got a bone box, a feather box. There are all the dried leaves from when we cut down all of this field. Medical supplies, they're all full stacks of bandages, tobacco bandages. Got maggots in there as well. I believe that's Brittany's inventory, what she was holding on her, because we had problems with that before. Uh, long stick storage, long stick storage, then stick, stick, stick storage, small stick storage. Long stick bamboo, well, bamboo long sticks, and then normal bamboo. Yeah, we've got a much more efficient base this time. Although, there was an entire section of forest over here before we started. The hell was that noise? And then, amazingly, I never even knew this was here. <clears throat> this is a kill trap. 
which is apparently always here next to the smugglers den it's just i've never seen it before it keeps giving us free pigs so how we keep it going it's uh, dead good dead dead good in fact i've got no fireplace there unfortunately so we'll just chuck that meat on there we'll destroy them destroy them there's not really much else to show you and let's take a shower beautiful just gets rid of the dirt nice and quickly we're not even thirsty we're hungry more than anything That didn't sound like a normal pig. I expect it was a normal pig, but it didn't sound like one. Yeah, I guess this is just going to be a massively shorter episode, isn't it? Well, apologies for that, but I didn't want to start another um, challenge in today's episode, just because I do have to uh, go somewhere very shortly. I did expect it to go on slightly longer than five minutes, but I should have known better from the last one. The next challenge we do, I am going to do it in one long video. So, there is that. And then we won't have this problem where I'm not sure how long they're going to be. Because apparently they're very short. So, yeah. That's where we're going to leave this video off. So, thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see some more. All comments and feedback greatly appreciated. As always, and other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers. <laughs>